As an official in post-independence 1960s Cameroon, Bia rose to prominence under President Amadou Ahijo. After becoming director of the cabinet of the Minister of National Education in January 1964 and secretary general of the Ministry of National Education in July 1965, he was named director of the civil cabinet of the president in December 1967 and secretary general of the presidency while remaining director of the civil cabinet in January 1968. He gained the rank of minister in August 1968 and the rank of minister of state in June 1970 while remaining Secretary General of the Presidency. Following the creation of the Unitary State in 1972, he became Prime Minister of Cameroon on June 30, 1975. In June 1979, a new law designated the Prime Minister as the President's constitutional successor. Ahijo unexpectedly announced his resignation on November 4, 1982, and Bia accordingly succeeded him as President of Cameroon on 6 November. Because Bia is a Christian from the southern region of Cameroon, it was considered surprising that he was chosen by Ahijo, a Muslim from the north, as his successor. His father, who was a catechist, wanted him to join the clergy, but at the age of 16 while in Catholic school, he was expelled. After Bia became president, Ahijo initially remained head of the ruling Cameroon National Union CNU. Bia was brought into the CNU Central Committee and Political Bureau and was elected as the vice president of the CNU. On December 11, 1982, he was placed in charge of managing party affairs in Ahijo's absence. During the first months after Bia's succession, he continued to show loyalty to Ahijo, and Ahijo continued to show support for Bia, but in 1983 a deep rift developed between the two. Ahijo went into exile in France, and from there he publicly accused Bia of abuse of power and paranoia about plots against him. After Ahijo resigned as CNU leader, Bia took the helm of the party at an extraordinary session of the CNU party held on September 14, 1983 In November 1983, Bia announced that the next presidential election would be held on January 14, 1984 It had been previously scheduled for 1985. He was the sole candidate in this election and won 99.98 of the vote. In February 1984, Ahijo was put on trial in absentia for alleged involvement in a 1983 coup plot. Along with two others they were sentenced to death, although Bia commuted their sentences to life in prison. Bia survived a military coup attempt on April 6, 1984, following his decision on the previous day to disband the Republican Guard and disperse its members across the military. Estimates of the death toll ranged from 71 according to the government 8 to about 1,000. Northern Muslims were the primary participants in this coup attempt, which was seen by many as an attempt to restore that group's supremacy Bia, however chose to emphasize national unity and did not focus blame on northern Muslims. Ahijo was widely believed to have orchestrated the coup attempt, and Bia is thought to have learned of the plot in advance and to have disbanded the Republican Guard in response, forcing the coup plotters to act earlier than they had planned, which may have been a crucial factor in the coup's failure.